Hi, Elvin. I um, skipped you the first time. I'm so sorry. I thought I'd counted it out, and then I ended up with five for the last video, and I didn't see you come up, and then I did somebody else. So you did a bonus video all to yourself. <laughs> it's Friday the 13th, 2023. You chose the question, where am I deluding myself? That's a really good one. <clears throat> so I'm using my Master Magpie deck. It's on a whole bunch of cards, like several full decks, and then bonus cards. So I'm just going to shuffle and pull. Where are you deluding yourself? You know what? I'm going to shuffle again. I didn't like that. That was a good question. I don't think anybody picked number six. There were several in here that nobody picked. I like that you picked a question that was... You know, it's going to be insightful, I hope. Okay, so this is the Wisdom card, and you see it's got the three wise men there. And this is card number nine, which is the hero. But this came from a different deck, so you get, it since this is a private video just for you, I'm just going to read from the book for you. Let me see if I can find the... This. Yeah, so some of these decks reorder the cards and have different numbers or they change it up. Uh, what is that? Nine. Wisdom. Okay. Here are the three kings or kings, three, or the three wise men from the Christian tradition replace the hermit. They're depicted um, at La Plaza de. Juna Diaz, Puerto Rico, where the three king, uh, where three kings de. Okay, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's also known as the Epiphany. Okay, so this card is all about Epiphany. This is the real end of the Christian season, so it's celebrated as such in most of the countries of Latin America. This came from a uh, Secrets of the Paradise deck, and that's why it's different. But I liked that it had wise men on there because that's what all about what you know. Um, um, going within and and um the hermit is all about okay it, it's a moment to follow your own star of bethlehem in this part of your journey the star will take you to a specific place in life and it's not a wandering moment but a moment to be focused on the outcome perhaps meditation and moments alone can help you find the light of your own star but sometimes going outside and starting starting to walk the path is a more efficient way to see light at the end of the tunnel and what number did you choose six the question was where am i deluding myself hmm. okay um this card represents a wish that has not yet been granted also the pigeons are a symbol of luck prosperity love and good fortune what three gifts of the universe granting you are the uh yeah what what three gifts is the universe granting you are they material things or spiritual things so this one came with some questions the three wise men represent your teachers and guides, so connect with spirit guides or the archangels in order to receive their guidance and teachings. Look inward to consult your own inner compass as well, because ultimately your own intuition and wisdom are your own best guides. The number nine is symbolic for a moment of change. Take this into consideration when you find your start, uh, find your start light. What needs to be left behind to start this new part of the journey? So this is really just, it's the, it's the, um, hermit card so you're looking for wisdom outside yourself when actually it's only found within and the the hermit takes some time out to go alone to to find his own path separate from other people because the the answers are never outside so this is urging you to take a little quiet time for yourself and and find your center and and get your answers from within and that was number gosh six again where am I deluding myself? Well, I'm not sure it's so much as deluding yourself as it, as maybe you're just not in touch enough with that side of yourself. So I don't see delusion in this card. Uh, it, it's it's more self discovery. So I, that's kind of what I would take. That's my takeaway for that one. Um, and so sorry I skipped you and you didn't get the group video, but um, you know you get a private one instead. So um, I hope this was helpful. Thanks so much.